Mm-hmm. How it is? Yeah, I'm good, man. Yeah, I'm good. Mm-hmm. You know, people, the man say, yeah, I'm good. And when a Jamaican say something, yeah, I'm good, you know, say it's really nice. Which one of the crab you like? Ah, uh, boy. You like boy crab? Yes. And who like the egg up crab? And you like the egg up? So why do you call it egg up? Because the egg inside of the Oman crab is tastes so good. And sometimes no egg is in there. Okay. So now we... So it look like you're the only person by the island to do this. And then we do like soup, same way too. Yes. We do conch and shrimp soup, so they are conch shrimp and busu. What the other one? Conch shrimp and busu. You know, busu man, like a thing from Portland. Say that again, Lord, Lord. Otterroad Krabi. Say that again, Lord, Lord. Otterroad Krabi. Yeah. All right, cool. So people, as you hear it, today we're there at Trelawney, and we're there at Otterroad Krabi. You hear what the baby say? Otterroad Krabi. And today we come to check out the famous crab stuff right at Hague, Trelawney. And I just before you reach at the only stoplight natural, not you mommy? Yeah, only stoplight natural. Only stoplight. Yeah, come from Montego Bay side. When you pass the eat and all for factory. And with that after that. See. And before you reach at the only stoplight natural, and with that same way. Introduce yourself to the people of me, please. Hi. Well everybody call me Miss Rose. Our Rose, our crabby wifey, our Miss Indian. Because uh, most people know me as we're out here, so basically every day from Monday to Saturdays, 11 to 5.30 are wild stock glass. Basically every day we do crab, wild crab, curry crab, barbecue crab, we do conch and shrimp soup, we do fried fish, lobster, basically whatever in a season, in a seafood, we do it just the same way. We do roti, if you have an event and you want to cater for it, it's just the same way, you do catering. Yes, that's what I say every day. And if you miss with yourself, I hear the Portmore, Greater Portmore by the farmer's market every Saturday, we do this the same way too. And how long now they are with us? About six years. Six years. Because what happened, we used to the road on the other side, rock, but them lot, the main road. See? So, in the new south here, so outer road, crabby, and me around there with the bar until we realize, say, now make it so we just close down the bar completely and then. Oh, out here, so friend, then. That was basically six years off. How do you get into this business? How do you decide to go at this one? All right. Before, when we run there, so we used to sell crab. We used to have some guys that sell crab in front of the bar. And then, when one year we decided to so go do a crab festival, in the Andrew Crab Festival, but the guys that wanted to supply them with the crab, them never care enough crab. So by a certain time, crab done. We have big, big stone of the inside, big stone of sound, and nobody basically they want to hear the sound. I just scrap them in one. Them one. Right, so that, right then and there, and this I say, you know, happen to him next year. He might do it for himself, getting a business and doing crap. And then eventually, we do the festival, we do two years at festival, and then out here. So, I'm uh, gonna get, gonna get crap. All right, well, we raise, we hunt, and we buy. Yeah, a raise. Explain to me what you say about them. Raising them, we raise them from baby stage. But crab take long for grow, so we still hunt crab and catch crab. So like no winner, people crab season, as I call it. Catch them, pen them, and then feed them, water them, and make them safe. So right through the year we have crab. How you feed? What, what crab eat? Well, they eat grass, mango, coconut, okay. cabbage, callaloo, basically any fruit and vegetable, and they love sweet stuff. So it's like the sweet coconut, like the jelly, yeah. ripe mango, melon, papaya, pineapple, banana, any fruit you can think of, crab like it. Yeah. And they like cool place, and you can't manage it. And they like them water. Oh. You have to make sure so every morning you have clean water, so you have to wash out them pen and change the water. And you water. concrete the bottom of the pen or? Yeah man, the bottom of the pen, concrete. Concrete bottom and continuous rook and run so they can climb up on okay. it. As long as they get a little climbing, they're gone. They're gone. They're gone. <laughs> so, buy crab and then, cause people, the fact that people know say we have crab, cause yeah. people like the idea. So see, like you know, say can go spawn or go buy a chicken. Yes. People like the idea, you know, say you want a dozen crab or two or three dozen, can just come around. Oh, yeah. say people want to cook it themselves. Them yeah, man, them buy and cook it. Ah. Yeah, man, them come to and buy and go cook it. Cause remember saying that you may cook it, but somebody want to cook it for them with. See. So them buy and cook it, how they want to cook it. So in that case, you want to just find around the yard. 
Paul är lördag och kokis. Paul är lördag och kokbra. Well, honestly, may I eat crab from your picnic? Because I grew up in a spicy land name, but I used to go like, what place him? I think out of Bengal or something like that, I could catch yeah. crabs, so then catch you and then cook you. And friends say, no, the most Jamaican people actually learn to cook. You have to learn to cook as a Jamaican people. Have to learn to cook as a youth. Yeah. Because you cook your own pot of bush, the dirty yeah. pot or whatever, till parents teach you. You have to cook. What's your girl picnic? <laughs> there, there's no girl picnic in Jamaica. You have to learn to cook. So you learn to cook and then you, you just cook it how people want at the same time. Because I remember saying, people tell you what they want, you know. So you have an idea. But you know, say people are saying crab cook with no pepper, but you can't kill it with pepper. Because some people can't. Some people can't manage, and then if you put too much pepper, you lose the whole flavor of yeah. crab. And All then, right. That's why you come with the barbecue too, sir. And I'm still copy ask you now, who who how you come up with the idea for the barbecue crab? Well, me and them. Because when I think it's like where I say, you have the curry, and then you have the barbecue. You have that was spicy. You have the curry was spicy, and at the same time, and everybody's stomach can manage curry. See? So, so why not try barbecue? Because barbecue is something what some people like, right. like with daughter. Um, baby J, she has 16. Get her anything barbecue. She love it. Crab, chicken, pork. It's when this, even the evening time when she comes from school, uh -huh. it's two foot or so left in there, make sure she gets it. I fear that. I fear it. See? But she eat the boiled crab, same way, you know, but she love barbecue. So that's in that sense, baby J, that the one who she had the barbecue, yeah, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. My little daughter or this and now she like egg up. What's the woman crab them? When they have oh. the egg in it, she call it egg up. Which one of the crab you like? Ah, uh, boy. You like boy crab? Yes. And who like the egg up crab? And you like the egg up? So why do you call it egg up? Because the egg inside of the woman crab is tastes so good. And sometimes you no know, egg is in there. Okay. One lady want to wear man, because some people can't manage to clean up with themselves. Oh, so you just clean up with them? Yeah, she are that way, so you clean up with them. So you cook your crab then with the foot and everything, Pony? Yeah, when I boil crab. Oh. Boil crab, you cook that way, because it's a boil crab, wrap crab, cook cola. Okay. But so like see. curry crab, if you want to see curry crab, you can show you that one already. Alright, cool. Boil crab, cook cola, man. Everything basically foot. Claw, everything, but yeah, some people can't manage it. They don't really know the difference in the back. What if you eat and one of you eat? So you just clean up it. Oh, Are you charging extra for that? No, I'm charging extra. I'm charging the same price as your crab. Okay. No services where you do, you can't. This is not taking nothing out of you. But you have to charge somebody for it. I'm not saying the person already has to pay crab. Barbecue crab. Yeah, that's a barbecue crab. Sure, uh, yeah, so, now we... so look like you are the only person on the island to do this. <laughs> I don't think you ever see this nowhere else. Most people always eat the barbecue crab. Yeah, that's a barbecue crab. It's like, if you're the person who can't manage your pepper, mm -hmm. don't like curry, you gotta take this because at the end of the day, it tastes nice because it's you know, spicy. You, know? you want to taste it? If you're the person who can't manage curry, uh, Remember the boiled crab coming whole pepper? Yeah. It's not really that spicy, a bit sweet, a little spicy, but you know, over. You know, you know, I'm going to beat mm -mm. you. But you have to have a taste of barbecue, because if you like barbecue chicken or like pork or so, then you will like a barbecue crab. But if you don't like barbecue sweetness, you're not going to really like barbecue. So what kind of, what kind of crab do you look after? Uh, with the barbecue, which is this, with the boiled crab, and then this is the curry. The curry crab now, you get a little spicy with the parsley. Well, if you eat crab, you don't like curry crab. Because they go good with the rice. Yeah. Oh, do you serve right? You cook rice too? No, we don't do rice out here. Reason being, we're not a restaurant now or a cook shop. So, roti, so we do the roti. Like roti and roast potato. And basically, most of us do a roti. Because most of us take the roti with the curry. Because you know, so everybody have this thing with roti go with curry. Yeah, yeah, bread, bread, bread. Our people just eat it by itself. Yeah. Okay, let's sit down. 
and you take off your nails them and you clean up it. Yeah. Most people take the curry because it's easier for you to hang up. Especially when they drive, yeah. easier for you hang up. So people more while come out and just come sit down and just eat them crab right there. So. People come out and sit down and come with their family members and just sit down and they trip there. So. Alright, so even over there, so the water, there are people come and catch fish in there. Because really? you know, like little fish is perch and lake in there. Yeah. What they catch? Come on, people come and sit down and eat this, so they don't care the man and eat. Or who don't have the time, buy and go. Okay. And then we do like soup, same way too. Yeah. We do conk and shrimp soup, so they are conk shrimp and bussy. What kind of other one? Conk shrimp and bussy. You know, bussy man, a little thing what? from Portland. Busso? Yeah, look at something from Portland, it grew up on the rocks on him and everybody just pull it up. Okay, like Willix? Yeah, but it's little, little, little. Okay. You realize it, see? Extra little, so I'll make a block something. Okay. I busso that. Mm. It's not a no shell funny. But you don't come in like Willix. To me, it tastes like a muscle stick. It tastes like a muscle stick. Here, I'm going to ask you, you know. Mm-hmm. Why you mind this smoke? Stand for the fire all day. All right, it's around here, then. Yeah. You will like smoke, so. Also, me need to move. You need to walk around here, sir. Me need to come. <laughs> <laughs> no, I have no smoke problem. All I smoke comes so I'm going to send me the air, so I can do it, so. Okay. Right, you feel the difference now with your eye? Yeah, I feel the difference now with my eye. Yeah, that burn eye. You will not burn your eye around this one. Yeah, man. All right. So, I'll like mask them over there, so Smoke good for them over there. Jerk rabbit people and the people them raise them own rabbit as well. See it there? Nice. That's what it tastes so good. Tastes good. It's like a very refined chicken. Oh, for real? Yeah, because people say rabbit tastes like chicken, but this refined, you know, trashy okay. and it gummy. And nice. So, like our all, Portland Fest are going this weekend, or Jerk Fest. Mm -hmm. What did they <laughs> But they are Portmore this weekend. Oh, that they are Portmore. I'm mean, there. So Portmore people kill if you ever. If you not show up. If you not show up, sat them on and killing them. <laughs> yeah, they kill crab if you not show up, man. For real, for real, for real. Alright, people, Jamaica Uncut, Trelawney, Haig, Outer Road, Crabby, and look more now, we are going to show you the, fa the crab farm, the whole process of getting ready, clean up the whole nine yard. But for right now, we just are going to take in somebody. Curry crab, barbecue crab, curry crumb, jerk lobster, and they kind of vibe it. So far. Mm -hmm. And curry crumb. So the people them have curry crumb, curry, curry crab, curry crumb, um, what? Jerk rabbit? Jerk rabbit. Jerk rabbit. Wild crab, barbecue crab. And I'll let me show you the salmon to roast me because it. Mm-hmm. Well, some people really like the thick one. Because sometimes uh, when we have runners, we have a cut thing called Indian's roti hut. Yeah. Or do the roti pick up the chicken or the goat or so and roll in it. Ah. So we make a thin one. Can you make a thin one? The thin one cook better and you don't okay. have to use that much. You know, take that long. So you work out. The thin one work out better. But yeah, sometimes people come and request a thick one, so you have to do it thicker. Yeah, and you have people. Video. Yeah, you have people want it. Oh, right, I don't do all this, you can't make it anyhow. Yeah. Okay. We make like a couple of them, like, you know, we make a couple of them and put them because the fox are roadside. Oh, just, just like any. Move fast. Right, yeah, like yeah, any yeah. fast food restaurant, people don't have the time for wait for you. So you make like one six hours so and put it down. Okay. But if somebody come and say, you like, say, they don't want it, they want it crispy, then you make it crispy. Okay, cool. And this is your, your, your homemade pepper sauce? Yeah. Yeah, and how often sauce. you have to make that this sauce now? Basically every morning because I'm going to a preservative now in there. Oh. Right, so, so what happens if you not finish? You just throw that? For sure we are just put it. Well you can do put it in the fridge and then if anything, like you can use it back with this because every oh, morning you have to cook. Right, you have to cook blend pepper every morning, see me. Okay. Where do you buy pepper from? Ah, we buy pepper like from the farm of them. We buy pepper like in a port more. Like okay. you order it and then carry down for you. Or not, 
the young man over there. But most of you buy a pork because it's cheaper. Okay. Okay. Sometimes you want a cup of seafood, so you know you're out, yes, sir. Basically, in a fall month, you get like a chicken foot, your cow, well, you get like a cow foot and something, but if you want something like seafood, you know you're on the highway, you have to come for it. Okay, see, see, So if see. a person come out here, so you know you're that, as they are trouble, man, say, I'm going to make a baby. I want out here. I can go buy a conk, and go buy a conk soup. Why people see a man, I'm going to say, yo, you know, someone that must have planned to make a baby. With all of them, I have soup, I have drink up and conk and then something there. So how many days a week you out here? From Monday to Saturdays. Monday to, and you don't work on Sundays? No, well work on Sundays, but at home, because on Sunday, you know, so if you make clothes, like pot wash back, farm, tidy up, house and them, something. So Sunday, would be basically, it's a working day, but it's not an outer road working day. And how, how early your day starts? My day starts sometime from 4 o'clock. For real? Start early. I have to the start? The latest days are Sunday. Oh, for real? Sunday, that's say you take probably wake up on 6 o'clock, because Sunday, like early, because they have. Yeah. To an extent. To an extent. Right. Yeah. But my earliest day, like, sometimes four, start five. Especially when I'm in go school. So people, Miss Rose, see our day start on average, four o'clock in the morning. And then Sunday, when it's quote and quote our day off, she still have to wake up six o'clock because the crab pen have to clean up, the pot them have to wash up, everything have to prep back to start back four o'clock Monday morning again. And them do this every day from Monday to Saturday and then Sunday's work now and when they stay home and kind of prep to touch the street again. See? See if you want some nice barbecue crab, curry crab, wild crab, jerk rabbit, link up outer road crabby in a Hague Trelawney and get your crab going. So far, a lot of people are going to come in and I get them crab and thing. You realize say, enough man come on, say speed, come get them soup because it's soup. But, shrimp, conk, and what else something? Busso. Busso. People have no know busso leave a coming on the bottom because I don't know that I know busso. But I, I look like a Wilkes. See? So just rock and come in and then I just a little more we're going to show you the whole preparation, the crab farm, the prepping of the crab and the whole works. So until we link up again, Jamaica and Cut, cut out. Mm -hmm. yes. I'm good man. I'm good. Mm -hmm. You know that people the man say I'm good. And when a Jamaican say something I'm good, they don't say it really nice. So in an outer crab season, how do you get crabs? Crabs are have another thing. Oh, so that time you use the one where you raise? Razor, you want to harvest you because harvest is not really last as long as ever. Just okay. feed them, keep them pen clean, keep them in, in a cool place. And about how much crab that's your raise? I have no idea, no, I have so one crab, when you one crab patch, you have to whole heap of babies and then in the earth. Okay, that's see. The pen. We have them in a uh, concrete and right. dirt, so then go in the dirt, really. uh. and then water. Oh, so you throw dirt on top of the concrete so they can't dig right. grenade when they can't dig right. come out? They can't come out, but they can't grenade because they don't seem like being in the wild. But, no, no, your crab pen then did rub one time. Same crab pen. <laughs> yes, man, same crab pen. Same crab pen. Okay. It's so funny, it's a man thief crab. Say, oh. No, we couldn't believe like somebody with a house for the thief crab. How's the thief crab? Can you crab them lock up? Like it, somebody said, they probably put on shoes for the crab them. No, 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 say crab no easy. I mean, crab on the crab on the one that I make up nice. No, you're going to crab in and you take a clip, crab clip like this in the pen and you, you take it out. The person will use your hand, just use your hand. Oh crab boy. Crab on nice and it's not like you can go this because it's on crab and so the one there for me, the one there for me. Because they don't want to talk about them. Yeah.